Uh, this hair is just like too much. My hair, I was just having a bad hair day. What's up guys, it's me, La Focha. So today I'm bringing you a collaboration that I did with Glitter Forever XO. You can go ahead and follow her on her um, YouTube channel. I'm gonna go ahead and link her channel below in the description bar. So today we decided to collab on doing a daytime to evening look. <laughs> something I interpreted. I hope that you guys really enjoy watching the video. Please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe on both our videos. And please tell us what you would like to see next. I have had a lots of fun collabing with her. It was really cool. <clears throat> Again, this was just something that we decided to throw together. Um, pretty much this is what I look like. I look at look like when I go out at night, especially I wear a lot of wigs and there's nothing wrong with wearing wigs. But don't forget to be yourself, live chula, and I'll see you guys in the next video. And don't forget also to subscribe to Glitter Forever XO. So with that, let's get started. Bye. So I'm gonna go ahead and begin to prep my brows up by using some Brow Perfection from Prestige Cosmetics. It's the brow gel, so that helps hold my brows pretty good when doing them. And then I'm gonna use the e.l.f. primer. It's in the green tone because as you could see, my pores and my cheeks tend to get really red. So we wanna reduce the redness when I put on makeup. Next step, I'm gonna use is the Gerard Cosmetics BB Plus um, Cream. It's in a gold tint along with my MAC um, Studio Fix Foundation. I'm gonna mix those two together so that I could get like a, like a highlighted color so that my, my face can be kind of beat and illuminated. You know how that goes. So just go ahead and rub that down. And this is gonna complete your day look because you want your face to look radiant, open, and awake not just kind of like zombie-ish in the morning, but something that makes you look like you've been up for a little while, kind of refreshed and you've been sleeping all night and you go ahead and just use a flat kabuki top brush and just bl blend that into the skin really well. As you can see, that's what I'm doing to my face. Next, I'm spraying the, the Fix Plus spray on my face from MAC and then using the Anastasia Brow Pomade in dark brown and I'm gonna go ahead and make my brows a little bit you know filled in because you could see at this point in life my brows are not all there they are not on fleek and they are they are not on point lately because I'm growing them out don't hate and with a spoolie just kind of just blend them out so they don't look too harsh or too dark and same thing with the other eyebrow And continuing on with this brow, I'm gonna finish this up and then I'm gonna now use the Wonder Pencil from NYX Cosmetics in the color light. And I'm using that underneath my eyebrow to kind of uniform them, make them look a little bit more sharp and cleaner. And also in the inner corner of my eye to bring out my eyes to make them look more open and refresh that look that I'm going for. Using a fluffy brush, go ahead and blend all that out until you won't see that anymore. And it's okay to use your finger or a sponge for this also. It's whatever you have at home. And using the color peanut butter and the chocolate bar palette, the semi-sweet one, you're gonna go ahead and just drag that all over the um, crease of your eye and just blend it out as much as you can. You don't want it too orangey, but also you want it to look a little bit like your skin color at this point. And then going ahead and using the color coconut cream from the semi-sweet um, palette, I also use that all over the top of my lid and completing my look with Kat Von D's um, mascara and I'm not using eyeliner here because this is a day look this is something that everybody can use this is something that looks like you just woke up you took a shower then you went to the spa that kind of thing nothing too crazy during the day just give your eyes some type of color a little bit of pop a little bit of brightness to them Now using my um, NYX color pencil and milk, go ahead and dab that in the inner corner of your eye and keep tapping it in until you no longer see it. And it just also makes the eyes and nose look a little bit more brighter. 
using my color, um, my MAC lip liner in Whirl, line your lips, and completing the lip look with the color Skinny Dip from um, Jersey Doll from Glamour Dolls Cosmetics. It's the Tracy DeMarco lipstick from that line. And this is affordable, that's under $4, so check that out, guys. And then picking up my side show view, um, blush from MAC, also blending that out. So it looks like you have color in your cheeks, and there you have it. This is my day look. What do you guys think? Oh yeah, complete the look also with the Fix Plus spray so that you don't look too ashy. Blend that shit in so you can look cute. I wasn't having a good hair day today. I just got out the shower. <laughs> Ta da! And going into our evening look, we're gonna go to use the color charm from the Pretty Little Miss Grace palette. I'm so in love with this palette, guys. It's so versatile. Um, this eyeshadow is pretty much like a, a teal. And I'm going ahead and I'm swiping that into the inner corner of my, I mean the outer corner of my eye into the crease and working it up with a fluffy brush until it looks kind of like gradient and really um, faded. And I'm going ahead and I'm putting on the color Twinkle Star, also from the same palette. It's a yellow, but it comes out really um, gold on top of the peanut butter color and coconut cream eyeshadow that we use so it gives it like this goldy kind of look and blending that out as you can see it's a little bit rockery and then using the color licorice it's a black matte color eyeshadow that I'm using and it's going to give it this smoky evening kind of look that I'm going for and continuing to blend that out on the outer corner of my eye and then using the color um, what color is this? The Caribbean, and it's from Jordana. It's a cat eyeliner. It's this really nice metallic teal blue eyeliner. I fell in love with it, and I was like, I have to do an evening look with this. Rather than using a black matte eyeliner, just I wanted to be a little bit more edgy and more dark, a little bit more glammed out in the evening, must I say. And then adding the color queen supreme from jeffree star cosmetics i'm putting that all over my lips <clears throat> don't worry i'm not gonna leave it like that just yet i look like a drunken prom queen a little bit i'm gonna use some toilet paper and blot out a lot of the excess lip color that i have on my lip because i'm gonna go ahead and blend the color um weirdo from jeffree star cosmetics also it's also black and i'm gonna run that across my lips again i'm gonna blend that in as much as i can hi abby she's jumping up and down as you guys can see and you're gonna get this kind of gray color. And going ahead and adding Queen Supreme again on top of that black, I'm gonna go ahead and blot that in with my finger and toilet paper to blend that in. And then get a lip brush and clean up the corners of your lip and blend it in. And because that green wasn't really working with me, I went ahead and added some darkness. So I went ahead and um, added some purple raindrop to the um, outer corner of my eye to give me this evening rocker glam look. Just blend it in as much as you guys can. Again, this is just what I have on hand. You can use whatever products you have. And this is the end look. I had to throw on my wig because, you know, I was not feeling my shower here. What do you guys think? <laughs>